Martin Tyler here for you, along with Alan Smith, of course. And our football today is from the Premier League. It's Burnley today against Manchester City. A big game this for Burnley. Well, they can't afford to get carried away, but uh, the fact is they've done very well so far this season. Mid-table, and few of us expected that. Long way to go, though. Every time I see Sergio Aguero, he seems to do something extra special. He really has weighed in with quite a few goals in this competition. George Boy, number eight, Dean Marley. Number 37, Scott Arfield. This is the Burnley lineup. Tom Heaton starts in goal. Scott Arfield plays with George Boyd out wide, and it's rounded off the team with these two strikers. Manchester City's lineup today. Claudio Bravo starts in goal. Vincent Company starts alongside Nicolas Otamendi at the back. David Silva plays with Raheem Sterling on the flanks. Sergio Aguero is the sole striker. Very few clubs in England have the depth of history that Burnley Football Club have, having got to the Premier League for a campaign. 14-15, they relegate again. Probably finding it hard financially to compete at the very highest level, but never underestimate what Burnley bring to the game generally. Great people, great town, it's only a town, and uh, it's amazing that they have such support. It is amazing, you, you walk into the ground and it's almost a throwback. It hasn't been modernised a great deal, but you get that old-fashioned welcome. It's an invaluable quality to have as a football club. It's Burnley, pressing on. Trying to thread it through here. They've coped with it well defensively. And this is going to be a throw. <laughs> Referee quick early in the game to give the foul. It's yellow, and the referee showing no early mercy here. Yeah, not an ideal one, that, for the player. He'll have to be careful with his challenges now. Uh, groaning really those who are backing him to maybe get one of the, the goals of his life I don't think he'll ever score from that distance well I think his manager might just have a little word with him at the end of this match Gal Clichy Good to add. Just working away to try and find an opening. To take the lead. Terrific stop. Manchester. Well, they've got to be careful with these early challenges. The referee's penalised that one. Well, the ref's given a foul here, and it's a bad one. Yellow. Yeah, no surprise there at all. <laughs> Defender to it first. 
Now he's looking for support. Decision is a throw. It was a fair tackle. Manchester City are on the attack now. And that's broken up by the defender before the cross could come in. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. Really strong tackle, and the ball's gone out for a throw. And for Manchester City, a match in which, when uh, the fixture came out, you think, well, they're expecting to win. Yeah, when you look at the money that they've spent, the money in this team, really, it should be a strong. Gundogan. Zabaleta. Now Fernandinho. Really on top of their game now. Wonderful understanding. He's got his shot off now. Away from the opposition and then suddenly totally out of control. But completely lost his head and he's just slashed at the ball and completely miscued it. What a miss. Marnie. Crisp defending there. Kevin De Bruyne. Silva. Looking to get the ball forward here. Manchester City. Good passing here. And here's the shot, saved by the goalkeeper at full stretch. On the front foot now, they've got a corner, hoping for the goal that will put them in the lead. Well, that's the sort of corner that frustrates the coaches because they obviously have shots on here credit for taking on the shot but well, what a good chance that was for him by his standards that's the glaring miss Marnie. Possession back with Manchester City now. Typified the competitive nature of this game, that tackle. It's only a throw in. Fernandinho. Well, it's an important area to win back the ball, that. Sergio Aguero coming forward. In quickly. There's still a chance for something to happen because there's three added minutes. Three minutes of added time. Carrying the ball forward, it's the Manchester City. Building steadily here, keeping possession. To put them in front, David Silva! Oh, great work by the keeper. So it's half-time and we're still waiting for that first goal. Manchester City wait for the referee's whistle and away we go for the second half. Now, here on the attack is Aguero. And now the shot! It's another decent try, but we're still level in this match. 
Well, when David Silva doesn't get involved, the team don't function, really, and that's why they're not functioning here. Well, he's almost been a bystander so far. You can see there from the touch map. Got to get involved, and uh, he might get a chance to put his team ahead if he does. Marnie. This could be a really good move from Burnley. Played into the middle. And he's headed it goalwards. He's got to it, and he's claimed the ball too. Kevin De Bruyne. Manchester City going to make a change here. Clichy. David Silva, such a clever attacking player. For Manchester City, off the pitch. And the managers and decided Sam for a change of personnel. To be replaced by Nolito. Clichy, really good attacking play. Trying to find an opening, not panicking. Excellent passing, great interplay. Now Fernandinho, a timely challenge. We've reached the hour mark, half an hour to go. Our field, possession in the midfield area. Manchester City are on the attack now. Trying to find a way through here, probing away. That attack was looking good, now the opposition have a chance. Marnie. George Boyd. It's looking good, this move. Free kick against Otamendi. Nicholas Otamendi gets a booking here. Well, that's risky going in like that. Well, he's tried to go for the slide tackle, and uh, he's a faction off getting the ball. It is a foul. Defender to it first. Nolito. Now David Silva gets it back. Now Fernandinho. Still 20 minutes to go. Trying to stretch the opposition using the wider areas here. Looking to get the ball forward here. Manchester City. Probing away, trying to find room for a shot, maybe. The shot's on! Oh, that's great, and the wait is over. It's a fine goal. They've worked away at the opposition, and now they've got their reward. Nicely taken, and patience has paid off finally. Goalkeeper was reaching for it, and it did actually touch him on the way in. I think there was just too much power on the ball, on the shot, for him to get a strong enough touch substitution for Manchester City coming off the pitch Substitution coming up as they look to make to sure the they hold their lead till the final the whistle. Team, Had to wait a while to get the first goal of the game. He sensed it was coming, it's finally arrived. Marnie. Ward. They spread it out wide here. Chance to get some width into this attack. Building steadily here, keeping possession. 
Shots on here. Oh, they've nicked an equaliser here. A rare attack. Oh, and the opposing manager is absolutely livid about it. What a strike that was. Well, it's come in from a long way out, and from that angle, it's not always easy to finish. Defenders caught out by it in the end. Well, this was all about anticipation in the box and getting his foot there first. Level, both sides have scored here now. Nicholas Otamendi. Zabaleta. Not rushing it here. Moving from one side to the other. There goes the cross. Clichy. Well, in a game where it will go down to the wire, that could have really been a turning point, but he's missed the chance. He's getting some stick as well off his own fans, and you can understand why. There is still time for either side to win this, with five minutes left. Cross is blocked here. Stephen Defoe. Crisp defending there. And carrying the ball forward, it's the Manchester City. Shot on! It could have been a really significant shot, that. It did just miss, but for a moment we thought that would have influenced the shape of the scoreline. Yeah, he uh, grimaces. He, he knows that was a big moment. If he could have found the target there... Round of applause for today's man of the match. Clichy. Attacking well here. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. And the decision for the added time is three minutes. Boyd. Here's Gray. Oh, he's through. Boyd. It's in. Oh, could that be the decisive moment here? Very little time left. It's a wonderful time to score. They're absolutely delighted. In many ways, this is the great appeal of the game. A team that's given little chance can win, as surely they've done with this late goal. Yeah, and I think every single individual has played at the maximum, as opposed to the opposition who haven't been at it. We had seemed to be stuck in a, a bit of a stalemate, in truth, but this very, very late goal has checked. And we're looking at the referee, and there goes the final whistle. And the match has finished here, 2-1. This is a headline result for the underdogs, a genuine surprise, not to say sensation. I think so. No doubt the favourites didn't play well, but the underdog team, well, they came out of the traps breathing fire. Well, he's had a very good game, hasn't he? Well, he had a good performance, and... Uh... Snatch that late goal to grab the win. But as for him, I think if he'd have been in better form today, we might have had a different result. But the fact is, he was below par, as was his team. Goalkeeper at full stretch. Moving away. Trying to find room for a shot, maybe. Shot's off!
possession. Shots on here. Here's Gray. Oh, he's through. Boyd. 